Living Uniquely You, myself Sharon Brown. I hope you are all doing well on this Friday morning. We had a beautiful, beautiful full moon last night. Really strong, really powerful full moon. And I feel it's probably bringing up an awful lot of resistance to move forward. To, the, to your heart's desire, your soul's truth, your soul's path. And it's really bringing up all that resistance within us. It's bringing up the fear, the anxiety... And then all that negative top pattern that drops back into us and it's stopping us from really moving forward. So I'm going to bring in the energy. I'm going to use the drum today and I'll pull a card again at the, after it as well and see what the spirit animal guides want us to know. I know we had the, we worked with the wolf yesterday and the lion so bring in if you want to bring in their energies as well i might even actually call them in just for the support to help you release that energy of resistance to move forward so i'm just going to ask you to take a deep breath in and just allowing yourself to just call yourself back from people, places, situations, time and space. So calling yourself all the way back. Allowing it to go through that divine filter of pure love and light. Calling yourself all the way back. All the way back. Down through that filter of pure love and light and breathe out. Take another deep breath in. And just allowing your energy to fully, fully drop back into you. So we want you in your body 100%. Nobody else's energy, just yours. And breathe out. Take another deep breath in. And just acknowledge how you're feeling, not wanting to change anything. So let, just let go of the self criticism, the self judgment. And breathe out. Bring your awareness to your heart and as you bring your awareness to your heart, visualise two big golden roots coming out of your heart chakra, into your sacral chakra, your root, your hips, your legs, your feet, the floor, right down into your earth star chakra and into the core of Mother Earth. Feeling your energy <coughs> and Mother Earth's energy combining as one and feeling this energy now move up into your earth star chakra, pulling your earth star chakra all the way down, down, down right down into that centre of the crystalline grid all the way down into your rightful place fully fully connecting in this is your rightful place on this earth allowing your roots fully wrap around the crystalline grid feel the second part of the grid and fully anchoring in your energy and this is your rightful place nobody else's this is your tr connection with mother earth Feeling this energy move up into your feet, your legs, your hips, your sacral chakra, your solar plex and your heart centre. Doing a 360 degree around your heart centre. Now I'm calling in the energy from source. Coming straight down into your Stella Gateway. Clearing anything that is stopping you from having divine connection. into your soul star chakra so you can see sense and feel your true soul's path allowing that to fully illuminate in front of you into your causal chakra so your intuition can be fully heightened into the crown of your head so you can think more clearly into your third eye so you can see more clearly. Into your ear chakra so you can hear divine guidance. Into your throat chakra so you can speak your truth with pure love and light. Into the higher heart, connecting into that universal energy of 
5G and allowing you to fully anchor that within your life and body. Into your heart so you can love you. You can see your beauty inside and out. Into your solar plex so you can unleash your true divine masculine energies, allowing them to fully balance within the body and fully accepting yourself no matter what. Into the sacral chakra so you can unleash your true divine feminine energies, allowing them to fully balance within the body. And remembering and reawakening your true gifts and talents. Into your root chakra so you can bring in the abundance of life and all life has to offer. Into your hips, your legs and your feet so you can take any necessary steps forward. Right down into your earth star chakra and into the core of mother earth. Feeling this energy now move all the way up into your feet, your root and your heart. Doing a 360 degree around your heart chakra. Feeling your energy, Mother Earth's energy and Father Sky's energy combining as one. And feeling this energy move to every part of your body. Every part of your being. To your 12 DNA strand, your cellular memory. Feel it moving, feel yourself now going right into your oneness, into the zero point, into the stillness. And wherever you're holding that energy of resistance, of moving forward, of taking the necessary steps that are going to bring you your heart's desire. And all that the full moon energy has brought up, all that resistance, Just take a deep breath in. And just allow and give yourself permission to let it go.
fully anchor in that energy oh now that was quite powerful I just felt I could see these chains of resistance literally on our ankles and on our hands and then at one stage I could just feel the chains literally breaking and us being free of the resistance that we've been holding on because the full moon energy it does bring up a lot of stuff and I felt that really what it was bringing up for a lot of people was that energy of resistance and allow stopping ourselves from moving forward so I'm going to bring in you're very welcome Kitty I'm going to pull a card now and see what guidance we need for the weekend then we have the beautiful 1st of February on Monday, St. Bridget's Day. Beautiful, beautiful energy coming in. So we'll see what we need to know for the weekend. What do we need to know? I'm getting the rest and gentleness before I even shuffle the cards. I see Otter. Happiness. Sea otters. Otters are amazing, amazing creatures. Absolutely amazing creatures. Um, they, they're, they are always very happy. Um, they love company. Uh, they also play with... Um, a particular they have a favorite stone so it what i'm getting is something to, if you have a crystal or something that you feel is very powerful to you what i would do is um i would really connect into that crystal because i feel there's information wanting to come through a crystal that's what i'm getting it's about playfulness as well happiness joy and rest okay it's about rest we aren't giving ourselves enough credit for and allowing ourselves to sit down and actually do nothing it's okay to sit down and do nothing claire happy birthday claire i hope you have a great day um so what i'm getting is for you to sit allow do something that makes your heart sing happiness is an inside job be like the otter be playful with something that is really really makes your heart sing and be happy but i'm also getting also that thing to do with a crystal there could be something or a message or an energy that's going to come in through a crystal that is going to literally bring out that happiness within you so I'm, and that's what I'm getting it's companionship as well it's about really looking on how we can make each other happy whether you're with your partner a friend a husband a wife whoever it is 
how you can make each other happy and or even just a friend or a family member. It's all about happiness, joy, love, happiness. I'll read the card now. See at our happiness, be the master of playful living. There you go. Release expectations and enjoy every day. Literally what we're after doing. Let go and understand. Let go and instead choose love. Surrender to the waves. So surrender. There's nothing we can do. Um, if things aren't going right, somebody isn't doing what you want them to do, there's nothing we can do to change that. The only thing we can do is really, really look after ourselves. Because when we're happy, that vibration goes out and everybody picks up on that. So we can change. We can change how people feel and we also we have the power to change and be happy ourselves so happiness really is that inside job your good your good destiny of love is sure so it's all about love joy happiness so do what makes you feel happy makes your heart sing and remember loving yourself is the most important thing we can do for ourselves so have a magical weekend guys and um i'm really looking forward to monday i feel there's going to be quite strong energies coming in for monday especially with saint bridget's day she's beautiful celtic um goddess so i'll probably more than likely bring her energies in on monday so have an amazing weekend thank you for watching this thank you for watching the replay if you would like to work with me on a one-to-one -one basis please dm me and also if you would like to join my portal activation group we are on the second portal of the year which is on tuesday it's 22 22 per month it's amazing so many people get so much the girls that are in the group find it absolutely fantastic so um i just it's it's a once a month thing it's a subscription you can join for one month can join for two months that's up to you so have a magical weekend guys and take care and i'll talk to you all on monday bye